you know, you can't come to the Independence Square, the Black Star Square, the Nationalism Park, or the Freedom and Justice without taking a picture or a video with this thing behind you, with this monument behind you. So, thank you guys for checking me out. Like I said, it's just a random video that I had to come to. And you know, when I was in, when I came to Accra, I had to do. So, um, I'll bring you here. You come and have this awesome view from the top. I was at the top there. Yes, you come have this awesome view. And then, you tell the world that Africa is beautiful. Ghana is beautiful. West Africa is beautiful. The motherland gave birth to beauty. That's what it is. So I appreciate everybody watching me. Uh, very soon we will end the year. And I wish everybody uh, good luck, success, more grace, more money, more strength, more health in whatever they do. Right here, I'm speaking from Accra, Independence Square. Freedom and justice. And then there, nationalism park. Thank you for checking me out. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Freedom and justice! Come follow me to a secret place where only the moon When you come to Ghana, where to visit when you come to Ghana. Let me give you some of the things you can do when you come to Ghana. First of all, when you land in Ghana, you need to take the next bus or the next taxi or cab or private car to Cape Coast. That is where you need to visit first. And when you're done, then you come, you come back to Accra to experience the awesome history that we have right here in Ghana. So I'm going to take you through from the Du Bois Center way, way down to the last place you're going to enjoy. So hey, keep up with my videos. Make sure you put up a comment and tell me if you've been to Ghana before. Tell me, hey, I was at the Kwame Kuma Museum and I loved it. I was at the Du Bois Center and I learned a lot and all that. So let me know. But right now, I'm inside the Kwame Kuma Museum where we have this. That is a statue right there. All right. So let me just go stand in front of it so you can see him for real. So he's our, he's our first president, our first president of Ghana. That is him up there. Yes, and he's saying, yo, you guys, we just gained our independence, man. So that's what it is, man. Enjoy my videos. So these are some of the things you can do when you come to, Cape, uh, when you come to Ghana, Accra.
is free forever. Ah! Hey, and who said that? Can you put up a comment and tell me who said that? All right, so let me give you a clue. He is our first president of Ghana. All right, so I came here right after the art center. I came to the Kwame Nkrumah Museum Park. This is where we have the monument of our first president, Dr. Kwame Nkrumah. Right here. So when you come to Ghana, Accra, and you want me to take you on a tour, don't forget that we're gonna come somewhere here and you're gonna experience how beautiful Ghana is, how awesome Ghana is, with all these waterfalls, with all these structures over there, you're gonna experience the real Ghana. So thank you for First president of Ghana, Kwame Nkrumah, was buried here. This is his tomb, right? And the wife was also buried just closer to him. That is Fatia Nkrumah. So this is Kwame Nkrumah's, and that is Fatia Nkrumah's own. So this place is sacred to be the Ghanaians, to be the Africans in diaspora who believe through uh, research, through checking our roots, ancestral roots and all that, who believe that we're from Ghana. This, this place is so sacred to us. So this is one of the places you should visit when you come to Ghana, all right? Peace out. Honestly, guys, when I went inside the museum of Kwame Nkrumah, I really felt something. I mean, the history was just, um, I wouldn't say it was crazy, but it was for real. Seeing all those pictures, taking it with him, Fidel Castro, um, the prime, almost prime ministers around the world, he met all of them. And it was just awesome. I mean, the picture was, the picture is there as, as an evidence. And the last picture that I saw, um, he had bowed down the head and then there was a write-up, unfinished, unfinished work. Unfinished work. It means there was, there was a lot he was supposed to do. But rest in peace to Kwame Nkrumah. So rest in peace to him wherever he is. So on our way out, we saw a monument. Uh, this is just the head, and then the body is there. I don't know what happened to it, but this is the head, like you can see there. And then the body is there. All right, so hey, these are some of the things, these are some of the places you can check out when you come to Ghana, when you come to. Uh, let me show you the last thing before we go. I've seen this peacock. You know peacock? Yeah. Thinking that they will make the same noise, but no. They are not my enemy. I have to go. <laughs> so, hey, I'm done. Hey, you guys, I'm Dr. Boyce Watkins, and you should subscribe to Echo Simpson's channel. 
Echo is a really cool brother, and I'm going to invite him to come on my channel. And so I will also uh, come on his channel 